You're watching CI Living at home in your community. Well, if you are looking to adopt a forever friend, look who's here from the Champaign County Humane Society. Aw, joining us on today's Forever Family, we have April Faulkner, humane educator and investigator, as well as Bear, who's anything but a bear. No. Introduce us to our little furry friend. Bear here is a four-year-old neutered male um, American rabbit. He is super, super friendly. Um, he's all, all snuggle, no bite. He, <laughs> he was brought to us when he wasn't getting along with the other resident rabbit in the home, so we think he would probably do best in a home where we, he was either the only rabbit or he was housed separately from other rabbits. That said, he's certainly a rabbit that can roll with the punches of a fast-moving household. His previous home had kids, they had cats, they even had a large dog, and they said Bear did great with all of them. Wow. Okay, he looks very large. Is that is that a normal size rabbit for his breed? For his breed, yeah, he's about um, a little over eight pounds. Rabbits come in all different sizes depending on their breed, but for a standard American rabbit, he's a good size. Oh my goodness, his little ears are just all perked up there. You know, do you feel like a lot of families, I know Easter is coming up mm -hmm. next month. Do you feel like a lot of people adopt rabbits and then kind of return them when they don't realize exactly what they're getting into? Do yeah, you see that? I think a lot of people don't understand how complex caring for rabbits are. They see them as cute and fluffy, which they are, but they have a lot of really specific needs and they have a lot of energy. Um, they can be free roaming if they're litter box trained, which Bear is. So they have a lot of potential to be at a super engaging, fun animal, um, but they do require a fair amount of work to get there. Okay, he's litter box trained. Litter box trained. What? I yep. did not know rabbits could be litter box trained. They can, just like cats. It does take a little bit more training than with cats, but he is fully litter box trained. He, if he's out about in your living room, he'll run to his litter box if he needs <gasps> to use the bathroom. Okay, because that was going to be like I just have this vision of bear running around, leaving little presents all <laughs> yeah. around the house, and like, why would you let a, a, a rabbit free roam? But if he's litter box trained, mm -hmm. oh my goodness, sign me up. It's not just rabbits mm -hmm. that you have at the Champaign County Humane Society looking for their forever families. We have some pictures here of some other animals that aren't um, all cats and dogs, but it looks yeah. like Bear may have a buddy there at, this, at the... Um Humane Society. Yes, that's Riley. He's a much more independent rabbit than Bear. Again, their personalities come in all different rain, all different spectrums. Um, he doesn't look as large. He's not as large. He is on the smaller side. I think he's just over five pounds, if memory serves. Okay. So he's much more petite in comparison to Bear. Still adorable. Yeah. And then we've got some um, rats. Yes, these are a pair of female rats. They're adolescents, so they're four months old. We do um, want them to be adopted together because they're oh. just they're buddies. Um, they're litter mates, and rats are super, super social creatures. So if they're alone, they'll get kind of sad and depressed. Oh, well, yeah. So hopefully there's a family out there looking for two. Um, little yes. rodents. And then look at this guy. This Aww. is Titan. He is a senior pit bull terrier. He is super sweet, about 10 years old, we estimate. And he's just a gentle, easygoing guy. Oh, bless his heart. Mm -hmm. So being a senior um, animal, are those harder to find families for? Yeah, they can be. They come with their own um, their own baggage, whether that be met medical or um, behavioral. But Titan's a really easygoing guy. He does have some skin issues, which means he has to be on a special diet. But he's been he's improved leaps and bounds yeah, since coming totally in. Totally manageable. And then of course we've got some little um, cats also Absolutely. looking for their for their families that we saw there. So tell me about this one. This is Layla Marie. She is a whopping. 14 years old. Um, she is looking to live out her golden years with a family that just wants to love, love her and hang out. She's sweet. She loves to lay in the sunny spots and get pet. She's just a really nice, easygoing Aww, lady. Oh, that's so cute. All right. Well, if people are interested in any of the animals that we've shared pictures of, or maybe they're in the market for a litter box trained ginormous rabbit, yes. what do they need to, to do? They would want to come in during our visiting hours, make sure that the animal's a good fit, you know, face to face. We can answer any questions they have, give them any tips and tricks, and then they'd fill out an application if they think that this would be a good fit for their family. Well, there you go. Well, Bear, his little nose is just a going. I think he's so excited that he's going to be finding his forever family very soon. Yes, I hope we, so. Well, we appreciate you coming and sharing him with us. There's a look at their new visiting hours when you can go and maybe meet some of the animals, including Bear. They're also on Facebook and I believe Instagram mm -hmm. and have a great website. We'll have all of that information at our website after today's show at CILiving.tv.